I wanted to do a brief audio tutorial since I've gotten a number of questions and compliments about the sound quality of my mic. Contrary to what you may believe, this is not an expensive mic. It only costs about a hundred bucks. Uh, almost all of the quality comes from post-processing in software. So with this tutorial, I can show you how to, using absolutely free software, doesn't cost a thing, uh, you can make any mic sound pretty good quality. So let me explain a few audio concepts first. So this is an equalizer. It's a software called Peace, which is based on an engine called Equalizer APO. I'll put links to those in, their in the description. They're completely free software, open source. What an equalizer is, is you have this array of sliders here that um, they represent uh, the frequency spectrum of sound. So. The ones on the left here are the lowest frequencies, as in the deeper sound, the lower pitch, you know, the lowest notes on a piano. And then on the right side are the highest frequencies. So as a demonstration, I'll set it completely flat, and uh, you'll hear what it's like with no processing at all. This is what it sounds like with absolutely no processing. Just a level EQ. All frequencies are the exact same volume. The way I got the sound that I do is basically just a process of messing with the sliders and uh, finding out you know, what sounds good when it's raised, what sounds good when it's lowered. What I do is I basically divide this into three sections, just mentally, that's how I think about it. You have your lows, you have your mids, and you have your highs. So let's isolate each one and see how it sounds with only each of those parts. This is what it sounds like with only the mids. In my opinion, this is the least desirable part of the spectrum. It should sound like I'm talking over a really crappy quality radio or some kind of poor quality transmission. I like to keep these low. They don't provide much quality sound, in my opinion. This is what it sounds like with only the highs. It's very, very lacking in substance, but you do get a a lot of the S's, the T's, and the, you know, kind of really important parts of typical vocal sounds. So this is essentially, I have a little bit of highs. I've noticed that the best quality sound that I've been able to get just from messing around with the EQ is you want to raise your lows, you want to lower the mids, and you want to raise the highs a little bit. Let's do that real quick. Okay, this is just a rough guess. I can't hear this in real time right now, so I don't know how it sounds, but um, this is roughly how I like to set my EQ to get the best sound I possibly can. So let me, I actually have this saved as a default. Uh, I called it good vocal here. Okay, yeah, so that's what my EQ looks like. And this is what the settings I use to get the sound quality that I have. I encourage you to look into it. You need to install Equalizer APO. And then after that, install Peace. I will leave links to both of those in the description. It's free and open source, so it's not like I'm advertising it. I'm just saying I'm a fan of it. It's what I use. So good luck to y'all.